In recent years, the long-range anti-ship missile, or LRASM, has made headlines as a game-changer in naval warfare. This cutting-edge missile system, developed by Lockheed Martin, has been garnering significant attention due to its advanced capabilities, precision targeting, and impact on modern military strategies. The AGM-158C LRASM, or Long Range Anti-Ship Missile, is a stealth air launch anti-ship cruise missile developed by the Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency, or DARPA, for the U.S. Air Force and U.S. Navy. The LRASM was intended to pioneer more sophisticated autonomous targeting capabilities than the U.S. Navy's current Harpoon anti-ship missile, which has been in service since 1977. In June 2009, DARPA awarded a contract to Lockheed Martin for the two-phase LRASM demonstration program. In December 2013, DARPA publicized its intent to award a sole source follow-on contract to Lockheed Martin for continued maturation of the LRASM subsystems and system design, which will be transitioned to the Navy. To outpace threats means to continue innovating with significant speed to stay ahead of the adversary's next move. Preparing and planning for the next move requires the right tools for the right mission. That's where multi-mission capabilities come into play. With more than 20 years of experience providing highly survivable and accurate cruise missiles, Lockheed Martin continues to develop cruise missile capabilities that offer maximum flexibility in a variety of domains and environments. The AGM-158 family of cruise missiles, which includes the JASM and LRASM, continues to offer that long-range stealthy flexibility for the U.S. Air Force, U.S. Navy, and partnered allies. To increase the capability it brings the warfighter, LRASM is focused on adding more air-launched platforms and expanding to ground-launch solutions. LRASM has been successfully integrated and fielded on the B-1B and FA-18EF, with integration contracts underway with U.S. services and partners for the F-35 and P-8 aircraft. Coupling the unique lethality and range of LRASM with the survivability of combat-proven HIMARS for a ground-launch variant provides a powerful combination, deployable in a variety of scenarios, including conventional and asymmetric warfare. LRASM has previously also demonstrated the ability to launch from a surface using an MK-41 vertical launch system or VLS canister with an MK-114 booster. Unlike current anti-ship missiles, the LRASM is expected to be capable of conducting autonomous targeting, relying on onboard targeting systems to independently acquire the target without the presence of prior precision intelligence or supporting services like global positioning satellite navigation and data links. These capabilities will enable positive target identification, precision engagement of moving ships, and the establishment of initial target queuing in extremely hostile environments. The missile will be designed with countermeasures to evade hostile active defense systems. The LRASM is based on the AGM-158B JASM ER, but incorporates a multi-mode passive RF, a new weapon data link and altimeter, and an upgraded power system. It can be directed to attack enemy ships by its launch platform, receive updates via its data link, or use onboard sensors to find its target. LRASM will fly towards its target at medium altitude and then drop to low altitude for a sea-skimming approach to counter missile defenses. As the LRASM is based on the AGM-158B JASM ER, the maximum range is estimated to be 500 nautical miles or 930 kilometers, although Lockheed Martin has claimed the missile's range is greater than 200 nautical miles or 370 kilometers. 
To ensure survivability and effectiveness against a target, the LRASM is equipped with a BAE system designed seeker and guidance system, integrating jam-resistant GPS INS and imaging infrared or IIR infrared homing seeker with automatic seam target matching recognition, a data link, and passive electronic support measures, or ESM, and radar warning receiver sensors. Artificial intelligence software combines these features to locate enemy ships and avoid neutral shipping in crowded areas. Automatic dissemination of emissions data is classified, located, and identified for the attack path. The data link allows other assets to feed the missile a real-time electronic picture of the enemy battle space. Multiple missiles can share data to coordinate an attack in a swarm. Aside from short, low-power data link transmissions, the LRASM does not emit signals, which, combined with a low RCS JASM airframe and low IR signature, reduces detectability. Unlike previous radar-only seeker-equipped missiles that went on to hit other vessels if diverted or decoyed, the multi-mode seeker ensures the correct target is hit in a specific area of the ship. An LRASM can find its target autonomously by using its passive radar homing to locate ships in an area, then using passive measures once on the terminal approach. Like the JASM, the LRASM is capable of hitting land targets. Some naval advisors have proposed increasing the LRASM's capabilities to serve dual functions as a ship-based land attack weapon in addition to anti-ship roles. By reducing the size of its 1,000-pound or 450-kilogram warhead to increase range from some 300 miles or 480 kilometers to 1,000 miles or 1,600 kilometers, the missile would still be powerful enough to destroy or disable warships while having the reach to hit inland targets. A single missile with a proper guidance system would increase the Navy's flexibility rather than needing two specialized missiles for different roles. Supporting various platforms makes LRASM a valuable asset for military operations. By expanding LRASM's platforms and capabilities, we are continuing to generate flexible solutions for our U.S. and international partners to substantially deter conflicts, said Lizbeth Vogenpohl, LRASM Program Director. The AGM-158 product family is transforming, enabling Lockheed Martin to support the warfighter in more ways than ever. New approaches and tools are at the forefront as this system moves forward on a robust development roadmap. In partnership with the U.S. Navy, LRASM is consistently evolving to include new variants that increase the weapon's standoff range, updated sensor packages, and other game-changing technology upgrades. This rapid development comes along with innovations to speed up production. The AGM-158 products are ramping up to deliver increased quantities to prepare the warfighter for ever-evolving threats.